hello and welcome back hairstylists today hairstyle has become a little bit popular with bright these days it's just a shion so but shion with a twist if you don't know how to do shion properly you need to learn this because that's the basic and some bride not some bride most bride just want something simple so you don't really need to do all those creative things i always do it's good to learn it but learn to do the easy one so that you'll be able to book more job and your page will be you have variety on your page so we're just going to take this out and i'm going to be clipping it just clipping it a lot of brides may do do this but brides do it a lot recently most of my brides have been doing it or they can do it and will add something to it i always say oh let's have something to it but i don't force them so as a bride i stylist i think it's good to help your bride but not to force your style on them some bride what they choose sometimes for me i'm like ah, it's too simple but remember i am there to serve them so i just have to work with them and especially if the dress that the person is wearing their dress is elaborate then we take that into account there's one wedding i did two weeks ago she wore a very beautiful dress and i'm going to put it on the screen so you can see when you're wearing a big dress like that sometimes you just have to make sure the hair goes with the dress because if the hair does not go with the dress, it becomes like the dress is wearing them. So we're just going to comb this, okay? Just comb it, make it straight. Okay? We take all the hair to one direction, we make it straight, okay? I'm going to be using a little bit of spray. I'm not going to finish my spray things are expensive so but if you're doing it on the read they had more spray to it so i'm just going to comb it do the band and then we roll and just clip it in like so that's it so on a good day okay on a good day this shouldn't take more than uh, if i say 15 minutes you guys might think i am kidding so 15 minutes if you already know what you're doing but if you are still learning give yourself time i know sometimes we say so, oh it's very easy it can be easy for me okay because i've been doing it for a long time so it will be easy for you but be patient with yourself so when any of you you are learning something just be, be don't be too harsh on yourself so that's why i always say start with something like this i'm in the shop the cars are passing so the noise so i say start with something simple like this once you start with something like this, you can do it, then you can move on. But if you try to start doing something very difficult, and uh, I would say if I say challenging, and you can't do it, that can make you get a bit upset, and it can even put you off. So please, if you know you can't do bomb, just keep on doing it. Keep on doing it, doing it, when you're good, if you say okay i want to start doing all those tricky styles then you can maybe take a course or practice more there is one of my students she recently came to do one-on-one she met me on youtube she saw me on youtube she has been watching my youtube video. i just remember and i wasn't meant to say that don't worry i'm not going to say her name she has been watching me on youtube and uh, some of the size she oh my god this girl uh let me turn this so that you can see uh, attention to details i said my attention to details sometimes you can use a clip but i don't have clip around me 
I'm using the pen. But on a good day, don't use this because when you're doing like the weave, it might be a, a bit more than this. So you try to use like a, this. I don't want to be making the noise. That's why I'm just going to use the pen. So I'm going to turn it so that you can see what I'm doing. Okay, hope you can see. So I'm just going to turn it. So she has been doing some of my videos online on YouTube smoothing so i'm just talking Ooh, i nearly burn myself i'm trying to do this because of you oh, so that you can see let me stay like this okay i think that's good and she came to do a class with me but i was so impressed when she showed me what she has been doing honestly i think that's why she pickups really quick because she has been doing it a lot of people call me chris i want to take one of your classes my question is have you done it before or not even anything just see if you have interest in it because time to practice especially when you're doing like craft work like this you have to spend a lot of time in mastering this is it we're going to get the padding yeah you're going to take a lot of time in mastering the craft so that is you have to love what you're doing so before taking classes or i know we always say oh come and take my class come at no before taking classes try to do just let it cool down so why that we are just going to turn this side okay before taking a class make sure it's what you want to do because it's not just by taking the class you can take the class but you need to be able to dedicate the time to practice so the girl really she did extremely well i think because she has been watching my videos that's why she did extremely well so this part we are going to turn it so i think i'm going to get up here so that you can see what we are doing so i'm just going to take the tongue just call it away i know some of you have been saying chris where have you been honestly i've been so busy god has been so good to me the business is growing i even have apprenticeships that comes i'm practicing the salons different days in the week and uh, don't worry you see me why i i've been so busy but i'm not going to leave youtube because youtube you guys made me uh who i am and uh, today so most of the people i see this fell down mannequin is extremely heavy so most of the people i see every day they i ask them where did you see me majority said we found you on youtube i'm like oh, i need to come back to youtube i won't stop don't worry so if any of you cannot get my course, you can be practicing from here. It doesn't matter. And uh, yeah, we'll take it bit by bit at a time. So just coil it. The barrel I just used now is 19 millimeter barrel. So I think it's good to have different type of barrel. Invest in it one at a time. There is one that I got from Amazon. It's like a set, a set of, I think five or so. I think that's good for a starter. You have, I'm just going to hold it. You have different, so we've done this now, okay? So we've done the side. You can tongue it as ever you want to tongue it. So now we're just taking this off. Why do we do this? We do this just to give it a bit of bounce okay it's optional sometimes i do this if i am uh, if i have time but if i'm doing bridesmaid hair i don't really do it so everybody know this okay wrap it spray we are stinging with this hair because the hair is not a lot 
so we don't want to put too much hair spray I would like you to support me on this channel a little support by clicking the like button okay when we do that that shows youtube that you guys are interested hopefully we'll keep on doing more so we just wrap wrap our hand around it you need to learn how to make your bun as well we have a tutorial on our website on how to make your bun a lot of people have it and it's just i think it's 12 pan or so uh if not there are other youtube videos that can help you learn to do that okay it's just on the course you're learning more in a control environment on like youtube youtube is good it might be a bit slow but you get there this should be probably 18 18 inch you can do it with 16 but it might be a different way of doing it like this so there are different ways to do it so you can have a 16 inch and you can still achieve the same you can still have a very long one and achieve the same so what i'm doing now is this i'm just using the ones i'm just folding it in mannequin is extremely heavy folding it in I'm going to pin it just pin it in okay the other one same thing the mannequin is sleeping I need to get a, a lighter mannequin for you guys I will turn it so that you can see I'm going to turn the other one okay that's it we've done it I'm just going to open it up so make sure you are happy the way it looks if you need to add one more you can add one more and then just open it so this is kind of where the work is basically you have to blend because the hair was coming out we have to blend so this is where the work is so you have to blend 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 when we finish blending we'll just pin it together okay you pin it and you have your beautiful bun so i'm going to do this quickly now and uh, hopefully we do well Just comb this side. We want this side to kind of meet nicely. Don't forget to pin. The side. The side should look kind of delicious to look at. And the other side and the back okay looks really good look at it on the side so when you're done if you like you can put accessory but for something like this it's better to use something really fancy 
okay that can make you look more like a bride thank you so much for watching this video hope you like it and i hope you are going to give it a try at home sometimes just do if you think it's too much on the face or maybe after doing something like this the bride is oh i don't like it it's not the end of the world you can take it and put it behind and then you have yourself another style let me put it behind so that we see what we have put it nicely with a comb and then push this into the bun and now you have yourself a different style look at it at the back because sometimes you might do something and the bride will be like, oh, I don't like it. But always ask a lot of questions. All my brides, you see some of my brides. I just did one on Sunday. I will see if I can put it at the end of the video so that you can watch it. All my brides, they are so happy with my work. Mainly because I've practiced and I know what I'm doing and I listen to them. I want you to do the same. I know a lot of you that watch me. I see a lot of you message me. I'm a hairstylist. Honestly, we hairstylists, we love our job. So, but we want people to appreciate it as well. So how would they appreciate it is by practicing and uh, making sure you are improving. And uh, that's it. Thank you so much. If you haven't subscribed, I did one yesterday that, uh, yeah, I think I'll post that one first. So every week, it might not be twice a week anymore, but every week, definitely, my video is on the way. Bye.